Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescaserace.com. Happy Thursday, coming at you with 2015 Panini Immaculate Collegiate Sports, Multi-Sport Edition. I think baseball, football, basketball. I think mostly football, basketball, but there's some baseball in there too, if I remember correctly. Um, and we're doing two cases right here, ladies and gentlemen. Two five-box cases, a dual case break. Big thanks to everyone here for getting into the action. So it's a two-case number block break, so it works just like our number blocks right here if you follow the instructions there. So big thanks to Gretchen, Sean, John, Joseph, Adam, Enoch, and Louie for getting into the action. There are the numbers right there. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Four and a six ten times for names and numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and tenth and final time after ten we got gretchen on the top and the bottom four and a six ten times for the numbers one two three four five six seven eight nine and tenth and final time after 10, we got 6 down to 0. Remember, 0 gets any and all redemptions, including 1 of 1 redemptions. And 1 will still get live 1 of 1s. All right, so Gretchen with 6 and 7, Joseph with 2, Louis with 9, John with 1, Enoch with 4, Joseph with 8, Adam with 5, Sean with 3, and Gretchen with 0. So let's sort by number right here. And we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any number trades, which could be possible. And then we'll have the break. Stick around. All right. Welcome back, folks. There were no deals done, which is all good. So that list right there remains the same in a dual case break of 2015 Panini Immaculate Collegiate Sports Multi-Sport Edition. All right. So here's both briefcases right there, 2015 Multi-Sport. Briefcases, both cases, I meant. This one we're going to set right over here, and we'll do this one first. Right, Dallas at the Sixers. In the background right now. All right, here we go. Immaculate Collegiate. has sort of the matte finish on here. I think they alternate between like the glossy finish and the matte finish. All right, it's all by number, so it's pretty easy. Bo Jackson, eight out of 25, going to Joseph Barton in the number eight. We got Corey Knebel. 15, uh, 65 out of 99. Out of Texas. It's a Dodger now. That goes to Adam in the number five. 32 out of 99. We've got Duke's Elizabeth Williams. That goes to Joseph Barton and the number two. We've got another Duke player. We got Michael Matuella, 38 out of 99 for Joseph Barton and number eight. Our first auto. 93 out of 99. We've got a dual relic. Kayvon Looney and Norman Powell. A couple solid UCLA players right there. Sean with number three. We got a Jamal Charles relic, 16 out of 25. Gretchen with number six. Let's make it a little more 
comfortable in a slightly bigger top loader here. Two color patch and autograph, Wisconsin's Melvin Gordon. 22 out of 99. Joseph Barton with number two. That's pretty cool. And Kayvon Looney again this time, three color jersey and autograph. 76 out of 99 for this Bruin going to Gretchen. Next box. I went to UC San Diego, so my, I guess my default collegiate team would, I guess, be UCLA because San Diego did not have a Division One basketball program. I think there are two now, maybe. All right, we got 11 out of 99, Eddie Lacy. John with that one. Danny Shelton, 10 out of 25. He is a big kid there. Goes to Gretchen at number zero. We got Pittsburgh's Brianna Keisler. 36 out of 99, going to Gretchen, the number six. And we got a five out of five Jabari Parker on card autograph in his college gear. And he was, he was pretty good. Adam Kupperman, another train whistle for you. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! I feel like those those knees betrayed him in the uh, in the pros, unfortunately. One out of twelve, Walker Bueller in his Vandy gear. Could be a Cy Young winner this year. Rookie player caps. One out of twelve, John with the number one. 73 out of 99, Deshaun Jackson. That'll be for Sean Maddock at number three. Oh, tons of fire, Josh. All over the place. We got the speedy Tyler Lockett, 32 out of 99. Joseph with the number two. And on-card autograph, Bobby Portis, 33. Out of 99, Sean Maddock with the number three. All right, next box. Good luck. We, we've got, remember, if you feel like you're not having a good break right now, don't worry. There's, we've got another uh, another case to go. All right, we've got Clay Thompson, and that is 89 out of 99. Clay Thompson going to Louis. Look how young he looks there. His dad, Michael Thompson, Laker, does uh, does color commentary for the Lakers radio broadcast. We've got uh, Desmond Lewis, five out of ten. I want to add him in the number five.
Brandon Dawson, 37 out of 99. Going to Gretchen in the number seven. What I love about number block breaks, we don't have to do randomizers. 23 out of 99. We've got Chris McCulloch and Hakeem Christmas. 23 out of 99, Sean Maddock. Rakeem Christmas, maybe married to Michael Jordan's daughter, I think. We got Richie Martin. Looks like 50 out of 99. He's with the A's now. Goes to Gretchen in the number zero. Out of 99, Bryce Petty, 65 out of 99. Adam with the number five. We got Jalen Strong to 25. Two color jersey and autograph, seven out of 25. Gretchen with the number seven. Ooh, and a Carl Anthony Towns rookie autograph coming up. Out of 99. And it's 52 out of 99. Nice. That goes to Joseph Barton, number two. I know, Bryce Petty. Remember Bryce Petty, everybody? Adam's reminiscing as a Jets fan. All right, nice Carl Anthony Towns. Another box coming up. Five out of ten. Odell Beckham Jr. in his LSU gear. We got Gerald Christian, 34 out of 99 for Enoch in the number four. It's a catch. Landon Collins, six out of 99. Gretchen, number six. We got seven out of 99. Andrew Benintendi for Gretchen. Got traded to the Royals not too long ago. Ooh. Stephon Diggs, three out of four. Chin strap. Wow. That's really sharp. Sean Maddock with number three. Nice. Sean, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. We got Immaculate Jumbos, Doriel Green Beckham. Nine out of 99. Louie with the number nine. Yeah, it's a catch for sure, TJ, right. Jalen Strong, 90 out of 99. Gretchen with number zero. And we got 49 out of 99, Rashad Vaughn, three color jersey and autograph, the UNLV guy. Concrete, if you if you don't want to wait, you're more than welcome to, uh, I think it's been long enough, and request a refund. Hit that support button on jazbeescasebreaks.com and request that refund.
Oh yeah, you, I do remember that. In his Vanderbilt gear, right? You, you still have that? The Walker Bueller? That was nice. Yeah, Conquer. Listen, when when anyone asks me, "Hey, is it gonna break tonight?" I'm always saying yes. I'm never saying no. It'd just be bad salesmanship if I said no. Craig Biggio, look how young he looks here. Sixteen out of ninety-nine. Gretchen with the number six. You still have it, TJ. Nice. Tyler Croft to ninety-nine. That's 30, 30 out of 99. Kind of hard to see the zero, but that's 3 zero out of 99. Gretchen. Melvin says, I stepped out of collecting for a year and prices get super jacked. Can someone explain what happened? I mean, I, I think it's been trending in that direction anyway, but I think the pandemic definitely kept people at home and people started to look for new hobbies. And I think just more people are getting into it in general. The athletes are now getting into it. A lot of celebrities are unboxing sports cards. Had a great rookie cl couple of years of good rookie classes. Brandon Cooks and Sean Mannion, 7 out of 25 for Gretchen. Oh, no worries, Concrete. Thanks for, thanks for your support. Yeah, well, that, should, that should happen tonight, I would think. We got late night tonight, too, scheduled tonight. So I would think at some point tonight we're going to get that going. There's Immaculate Jumbos, 15 out of 99. That goes to Adam in the number five. We've got Marquise Lee, 66 out of 99. That goes to Gretchen in the number six. we got Mike Davis, a Gamecock, 78 out of 99. Two color jersey and autograph. Is that what those look like? Ooh, we got a nice rookie, Devin Booker, to 99. 15 out of 99. Adam with the number five. Nice. That's pretty strong. Because of Anthony Davis' injury, Devin Booker, now an all-star, too. Nice, and his college gear, it's pretty strong. We've got a rookie autographs, Amari Cooper. It's expired, Gretchen, with the number zero. Zero gets any and all redemptions. But Panini might be able to, 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 to hook you up with something. Whether well, maybe points. Some people have said that they stopped hooking people up for expired redemptions, but I don't know. Kill, kill him with kindness. And, then, and there's Montrezarel. 9 out of 99. Louisville. Goes to Louie in the number 9. Current Laker. And uh, reigning 6th man of the year. All right. That was the first case. Let's do the next case. I'll set these aside. We can do a quick uh, recap at the very end. And here's another one. <laughs> if I could grab that properly right there. Yeah, TJ saying, I dug out some Booker autos last night and happened upon an RPA that last sold for 800 bucks. Nice. Yeah, sometimes it's worth, especially if you have a lot of cards laying around, sometimes it's worth just looking through your collection again and seeing maybe... There could be a break with some random rookie cards of players that might be pretty good that maybe weren't good at the time you did that break with us years ago. You know, we've been doing this. We've, we've had a lot of regular customers like TJ for like the last seven years. So there's got to be some stuff you've done with us seven, six, five years ago that are just laying around where you can find some treasures like a Devin Booker RPA. That's not bad.
No, I agree. Justin Clement, Devin Booker probably should have been an all-star even before AD's injury. That was one of the biggest omissions, I think. All right, another case. This is our second case. Good luck. We've got 5 out of 25 OBJ. Going to Adam in the number 5. We've got Deron Hilliard, 40 out of 99, going to Gretchen and the number zero. What's that? There's a little bit of cardboard dust in there. Let's get that out of here. There we go. We got Kalen Clay, 78 out of 99, going to Joseph Barton and the number eight. We got 10 out of 99, Riley Farrell. Going to zero, Gretchen with the number zero. Dual Relic, 10 out of 99. We've got um, Rondé Hollis Jefferson and Stanley Johnson. former Wildcats. I think they're still in the... These guys are still in the league, right? They're still playing. He is, definitely. Gretchen with zero. We got A.J. McCarron. 35 out of 99. <laughs> remember, remember when... Remember when creepy old Brent Musburger was like drooling over his girlfriend? That was a little weird. 35 out of 99, Nelson Aguilar. Adam with the, I guess, current free agent. I, I don't know. I think he played pretty decently. He might have priced himself out of the Raiders organization. Two-color jersey and autograph. Jarrell Martin, 17 out of 25. Gretchen with the number seven. All right. I agree, TJ. Yeah, the hobby is definitely back. And it'll stay for a while. Yeah, with Kevin Durant and, and Mark Cuban investing in, in companies related to the hobby. I think someone was saying that, like, places like The Ringer have created, like, hobby-related podcasts. You know, so there's more content being generated around this sort of stuff. I think group breaks, since there's just more and more experience and high quality uh, group breakers have been also available. So I think that has helped people kind of get introduced to the hobby. A lot of different new ways to consume products. So I think all of that has all come together. And before it was only a small percentage of people really getting into group breaks. You know, and now the pie has increased, so there's more more people getting in on it. There's Blake Griffin, 72 out of 99. Joseph. Dante Fowler Jr., 12 out of 99. Joseph. I know. Raiders on the Russell Will. I, I saw that, Mike Tower. So does that basically means, like, if the, if the Raiders don't do their due diligence fans are not going to be pleased, right? Like, that's almost like you're kind of home-wrecking. If I'm, if I'm Derek Carr, you know, I'd be, I'd be a little annoyed. Russell Wilson home-wrecker? Immaculate numbers, Rashad Perriman, 17 out of 25. Gretchen with the number 7. Gretchen also also admittedly buys a lot of spots too. That that always helps the luck when you have the when you have the odds on your side. Doriel Green Beckham five out of twelve for Adam, and the number five.
59 out of 99, Larry Nance Jr. Rookie auto for Louie in the number nine. All right, all right. Not sure about top shot, Adam Kupperman saying, but he redeemed his Justin Herbert blockchain and immediately got a ton of $5 offer on the Panini site. Interesting. So people are active on that, huh? 82 out of 99, Bryce Petty, Joseph Barton. Jaleel Okafor, 64 out of 99 for Enoch in the number four. Stanley Johnson, 94 out of 99. It's another one for Enoch. And 93 out of 99, Norman Powell. And he's UCLA gear, going to Sean Maddock and the number three. Right, active with lowball offers. Can you set a minimum on there, Adam? All right, a few more boxes to go. And don't forget, Joshua, you don't hear all the times I don't say her name. You know what I mean? <laughs> In group breaks that she's a part of. I feel like that happens when, when someone sees someone win like break credit a few times in a row. They're like, this guy's winning break credit all the time. And then I'm, uh, and I'm always like, well, don't forget about all the other times that person was, was involved in break credit and never got it. A lot more than the times they win. It's usually the trend. All right. Next box. Good luck, everybody. We got young-looking Clay Thompson right here. That is 9 out of 75. I think Louie got the other Clay Thompson, too. You could set it, so Adam said you could set it up a blockchain as an auction and pick the starting price, but not sure if I can leave it open for offers with a minimum. All right, interesting. So it's offers, any and all, no, 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 no floor ceiling, or just a straight up auction, and you see what happens there. Interesting. Eric Hendricks, one out of 99. Part of that great UCLA defense for a while back. That'll go to John and the number one. 33 out of 99, Michael Pruitt. That'll go to Sean and the number three. We've got Jordan Matthews, four out of 49. Three color patch and autograph. That's Enoch with number four. One person did offer 150. Yeah, I think that's a little more fair, but I think still think for Justin Herbert, probably be able to get more than that. Especially as you get closer to, uh, especially as you get closer to the uh, regular season. Leonard Williams, 37 out of 99. Gretch. Twenty out of ninety-nine. Rod Woodson, also for Gretchen. Rod Woodson went to Purdue. Yeah, I think he went to Purdue. Devin Smith, twenty-nine out of ninety-nine. Three-color jersey and autograph from the Ohio State University. Louis with number nine. And we've got. Rondé Hollis Jefferson, three color patch and autograph 24 out of 99 for Enoch and four. Two more to go. Chain stuff, Mr. Flyer. I, th I think it's still like a work in progress, you know? I think they're still trying to figure out how to 
kind of leverage a sort of digital card market. You know, so I think I think uh, there's still still a work in progress, but I think it's an interesting start to. I think it's an interesting start for uh, for an entry into the the digital card world. I think I think the physical card will still be the main thing for a long time. But entering the digital world is interesting. Yeah, that that seems to be the problem with Top Shot. It just feel like no one can actually get can actually get cards, get packs. There's Chris Paul, thirteen out of ninety nine, going to Sean in the number three. There's Preston Tucker, fifteen out of twenty five, five for Adam. We got JP Takoto. 86 out of 99. Two color jersey and autograph. Going to Gretchen in the number six. Out of 99, we've got D'Anthony Thomas and Marcus Mariota. 55 out of 99. Dual relic for Adam in the number five. Walker Bueller. 60 out of 99. Going to Gretchen in number zero. Justin Clement saying, come on, everyone, let's get the Big Hit Express on track. Are we off track? That implies that we are off track. I think we're pretty on track right now. Nice little break going on. 79 out of 99, Justin Hardy. That goes to Louie in the number nine. I like that, that sort of pirate logo there. We've got Simi Coates, Sammy Coates, two color jersey and autograph, 29 out of 99 for Louie. Ooh, and another Carl Anthony Towns to 99. Back from COVID, he's back and healthy. So good to have him back. 47 out of 99, that's Gretchen with the number seven with the Carl Anthony Towns, a wild cat, has appeared. On card autograph, rookie on card autograph. All right, and the final box, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for getting into the action. We've got more, I see. I guess I, I don't know if anything sold out after this. I do see about six, seven orders coming in. So we'll take a look at those. See what we can, what else we can get into. Oh, we got a pretty thick card. T H I C C. Right there. Good luck. Adrian Peterson, 61 out of 99. John. Jalen Collins, 2 out of 5. Joseph with the number 2. Out of 5's and under Joe, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Vic Beasley Jr., 86 out of 99. Gretchen with the number six. One out of 25, that's James Caperlian. Where is he? I feel like he was supposed to be a kind of a big name. What his status is right now. John with the number one. All right, and it's soul of the game. It's Mason Plumley. It's a piece of his sneaker. Look at this. Wow, soul of the game. One out of 22. John with the number one gets a piece of the bottom of his sneakers. Looks like definitely worn as well. 
It says it just says play, it doesn't say game worn, but it's player worn. You can tell that it is definitely worn. That's pretty awesome. Nice one, John. That's pretty sweet. All right, a few more to go. We've got Robert Refsnyder, 10 out of 99, zero, Gretchen. We got Garrett Grayson to 99 coming up. It's 37 out of 99. Garrett going to Gretchen. And the last one is Terry Rozier to 99. He's pretty solid. That 37 out of 99 rookie auto. Again, number seven going to Gretchen. There you go, Gretchen. All right. Right, hopefully hopefully not worn, not player worn at the dog park. That would not be good. All right, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. So let's do a uh, quick recap. I guess I'm kind of doing the break over again, but this break's been long enough, about 40 minutes, where we can do a quick little recap to show you what we got. Not too bad for, I like that chin strap. That Stefan Diggs chin strap is pretty solid. Got some Ben Intendis. We got some Carl Anthony Townses were nice. You know, so it's pretty good stuff. Multi sport, collegiate, mostly football and basketball, but they mix in a little, little baseball there. Melvin Gordon. Terry Rozier was nice. Got the Mason Plumley. Vic Beasley, more Carl Anthony Towns. Wrinkly on the penny sleeve there. There's Justin Hardy, Walker Bueller. B. Clay, break the one and one. Yeah, when it sells out, we'll break it. Not sold out yet, unless those two filler packs sold out already. So help me help us fill that up, and then we can do it. All right, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. 2015 Panini Immaculate Collegiate Sports in the books. A dual case break. Thanks, everyone, for getting in uh, to random number block break number one. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for more. Bye-bye.